First Things First is sponsored by Ram Trucks, built to serve. He's been up all night. Oh, man. Fire <laughs> Everybody and knows it. Fire and take. <laughs> Live from New York, it's the show that would always go up four in a playoff game. I mean, it seems like a good choice. Should we go up four? Should we not? I'd go up four. <laughs> I could go up three, and if the ball hits the rim, it's just in the air. No, like I think punt. going up well, four. Look, if a guy hit a half-court shot while being fouled, Four-point play. Yeah, th- then you know what? You'd be happy if you were up four. That's, <laughs> that's first things first. Today, did we just watch the end of the Warriors dynasty? Mm, I hope not. Meanwhile, a monster article dropped about Bill Belichick's coaching search, why the Cowboys and the Eagles' current coaches should be very worried. And finally, a special playoff edition of the best segment in all of sports. It's not power rankings, which you can find in the USA Today next to the breakfast buffet at your local Marriott. It is Nick's tears alongside Chris Broussard and Kevin Wilds. Nick, any surprises in the playoff tiers? New team at the top. Who was New it? team at the top. Well, Last it was year. the team we're showing. Last, Last week, week the, the final edition of regular season tiers. At Denver at the top. Okay. There is a new team at the top. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. I mean, we lost the Spurs. New team at to the top. Yeah. Okay. We start with the Lakers putting the Pelicans in the blender. <laughs> well, <laughs> 20 and you 15. Like that. I did. You I like that. Was good. 20 and 15 from AD and 23 from LeBron. Despite the King running out of gas in the fourth, a little bit of editorialization in the newsreel. That doesn't seem You fair. always do that for LeBron and LeBron only. And then what, you're did like, he, I love LeBron. I do. <laughs> Go ahead. Did he play well? No, well, again, like you said, editorialization in the newsreel. Let's get to it. Here's Anthony Davis. <laughs> I think we're clicking at the right time. Uh, we still have a lot to um, you know, accomplish. And you know, our goal wasn't to win 12 out of 15. Uh, you know, obviously, we're taking it one game at a time, but um, I think we're clicking at the right time. You know, guys are playing well, guys are, are very confident, guys are found their rhythms, uh, and we're going to need it, uh, especially for this series. Okay. Should Lakers fans be happy with last night's win? 100%. And the game after was why. I know, Brew, you're disappointed that I didn't do the no, they shouldn't be happy. They should be ecstatic. I saw it in his eyes waiting for it. I thought it was I, I, I know you did. I, I, I almost did it. I was like, yeah, three days in a row is too much. Um, the game after was why? Because you lose last night's game. Yeah, you avoid Denver, and yeah, there's, you know, these other things open. But guess what? Your second best player can go 0 for 10, and an undrafted essential rookie can have the game of his life, yep. and you're just going home. The other reason, because last night I want to be clear, the Lakers played, I thought, really well for about a 18-game minute stretch. You know, the, from the, the second quarter into the first half of the third quarter, though, you know, across halftime. And the first quarter, they didn't play well at all. And then the final 18 minutes of the game, they were holding on for dear life and I thought played poorly. Mm -hmm. And LeBron did look out of gas. And I think more was taken out of him than the broadcast acknowledged from the Zion charge and the following charge that he took. But they've been playing. They were also mentally exhausted. They've been playing do or die games for a month, essentially. When they lost to the Warriors on March 16th, they were 36 and 32, trying to avoid the 9-10. Mm-hmm. And so it was an ugly win. I didn't think LeBron played great. I didn't think AD played great, even though AD made the play of the game off the LeBron miss, getting the rebound and getting fouled. But it sets up, in my opinion, the ideal scenario, and it gives them for the first time in more than a month a margin of error that they didn't have and they certainly wouldn't have had on Friday night. So, yeah, they should be happy with it. Yeah, they absolutely should be happy. Obviously, you got to face Denver, but we knew that was coming. They've been preparing for that, all right? You didn't want a one-and-done situation. You you talked about, and we'll get to the Warriors, but you can just go cold in today's NBA. When you're shooting so many threes, even the Lakers who don't shoot a ton – relatively speaking, you still can go cold. They shoot enough. Uh, And the other team can get hot. And that's a team that's beaten you eight out of nine times in Sacramento. So you don't have to worry about that. But on the court, to win a game on the road where they've been bad, all right, and where your two best players don't play well for the most part, AD and LeBron shot 12 for 36, 33%. And you still won. And what you like, if you're a Lakers fan, Because especially going into this series with Denver, you're going to need this. The others, as Shaq would call them, stepped up. 
Yep. D'Angelo Russell, who is not – he's been historically bad in the playoffs. Yep. All right? Steps up, hits the huge shot. 51 seconds mm-hmm. left. Probably put the him up biggest four. shot of his career. Mm-hmm. Possible. No, I mean, because he's never made a big shot in the playoffs. Shot. What about all this? I've seen this a yeah in the regular season. I think that was probably the, the biggest, biggest shot of his. Well, look, yeah. he said all the public criticism has hardened him and made him tougher. Yeah. And last night, if you're a Lakers fan, cling to that. Yeah. Cling to that shot. Austin Reeves, nice game, 16.6 assists. Yep. Fourth quarter when LeBron was struggling, he was the plays getting stuff, getting the ball to yep. AD, and Gabe Vincent who we know how big he was last year for Miami, probably has his best game of the season. I know he hadn't played that much, but when he has played, he's been inconsequential. So last night he plays well. So, yeah, all things considered, I got to face Denver no matter what. That's exactly right. Last night, you almost would – look, a blowout, you go into that series feeling good. But the fact that your other guy stepped up and played well, I like that. And by the way, Brew, credit to you because you, myself as well, but I I guess an emotional investment, we both had the courage to pick the underdog yesterday and we're proven correct while Wilds went with the safe, easy favorite pick. Wilds, we told you. Yeah, guys. We gave you reason after reason after reason. D'Angelo Russell hit a wide open three. Uh Brandon Ingram was still, I guess, I I felt like he regressed from the previous game. He did. And Zion was out. If Zion stayed in those last three minutes, maybe, knows? maybe, and maybe. And we're like, I mean, Zion oh, was Gabe Vincent, he's the, finally back. Well, he, he scored nine points. Yeah, for Gabe Vincent, yeah, that's Wilds, big. He's their ninth man. What do you expect? You, you, you love Jackson Hayes. How many times has Jackson, Jackson Hayes scored more than Jackson, I like this Jackson year. Hayes a lot. Exactly. Well, I'm just saying, you've, you're, mm-hmm. the elephant in the room is that Zion checked out of the game with three minutes left yeah. when when there was a avalanche of points coming at the Lakers. Yes. Before I we start laying think, flowers at the feet. I still of think the Lakers, Lakers would have won. The eighth best yes. But maybe. Who but knows? here, but the other the flip side to that quickly is that Zion. Through 45 minutes of game action, had 40 points and 11 rebounds, the best game arguably of his career. Yep. LeBron and Anthony Davis weren't playing well, and it was a tie game. It's not as if when Zion because went out of the game, the the, right, because of the others. Brew, your analysis pregame yeah, okay, and postgame you. was Thank spot you. on. Thank you. Well done. All right. Now, let's <laughs> you can't please this guy. No, you can't. Let's get to the main. The Tigers. The main player. I wanted the Tiger. The star of the show.